Hello, this is Max Williams with United Real Estate, and today I'm in Western Henrico. More specifically, I am off the Cuyacuson Road corridor, and today we're going to take a look at a one bedroom, one and a quarter bath condo. And you're probably saying, okay, Max, what is a quarter of a bath? Well, you stick with me and you'll find out here momentarily. We are located here in a really nice, well maintained community. Uh, we've got some amenities here. I believe there's a pool. And uh, I often have people contact me and say, Max, I, I think I want to live in a condo or a townhome. And as with many uh, types of housing, there are always advantages and disadvantages. One of the disadvantages of living in a condo or townhome is you've got a maintenance fee or an HOA fee, actually, uh, that you have to pay every month. And that goes to cover maintaining the building, maintaining the exterior, and any amenities that may be in place. In this particular community, we've got a swimming pool that of course must be maintained. Uh, the HOA here, I keep saying HOA, um, I use that interchangeably with association, is just over $190. And that's a Nice little chunk of money when you consider that the asking price on this condo is 94000 It comes in at just over 870 square feet. Now we've got nice walnut colored floors here. This area here would be nice as kind of a formal dining space. We've got a galley style kitchen. I'm going to pop through. Got a little pantry storage there. They painted these cabinets, they could probably use a little touch up. And if I were buying this condo, I'd probably come in and just redo these countertops, put something in a little bit more modern. That hole there is where your dishwasher would go. So you've got a nice modern kitchen. And then straight ahead, you've got another space. This would be great for informal dining. Nice and bright, you of course have that big, big window there looking out over the community. We've got a little area here, this is kind of neat. This is a great place for maybe a piece of wicker furniture or two, and you can open those sliding doors on the other side and get a nice little breeze. So we've got a really interesting little layout here. Uh, I do not represent the seller, and um, one thing that is really good about this area is you probably will not be able to buy anything in this price range in this area, uh, definitely under 100,000, very, very tough to do. Space there for your stackable, washer dryer. Uh, the schools here in this area, if you're at all familiar with Henrico, you know we've got world-class schools here and every middle school and high school gets a laptop. That's kind of a claim to fame that surprised a lot of people that are not from this area. Okay, we're gonna transition back into our bedroom. Uh, we've got a nice size bedroom here. Once again, wood floors transition throughout this entire Unit. There is no carpet, so if you are an allergy sufferer, you don't have to worry about dealing with the issues that carpet presents. So we've got a coat closet, a linen closet, and then this, you're in for a treat here. You're in for a treat. Okay, we've got a vanity. And then on the other side, it doubles as a walk-in closet. So I'm not sure what the rationale was to put a vanity right there in the walk-in closet, but um, this, is, this is the second home that I've seen where they've actually done that. The other home that I saw, they actually put it in a closet closet like this. It was about two feet deep and they put the throne right there in the middle. So not sure what their thought process was there, but uh, it is an interesting layout nonetheless. Uh, just the other day I was, uh, on a photo shoot, I am a semi-pro photographer, and I was shooting a, a young lady, uh, her name is Nisi, and Nisi said, hey, I, I know you. I said, where do you know me from? She said, you, you, you're the real estate guy that does the videos. And I said, yes, I am. So it was kind of a, a small world uh, experience there. I want to give a shout out to Nisi. Thanks for taking the tour. If you have any questions about this or any other homes on the market, I'd be happy to help. My name is Max Williams. I can be reached on Facebook at Richmond Area Foreclosures on YouTube under my name, Max Williams Realtor. Have a great day.